Here we go, man. Arc Official Conquest servers. Fresh character. Somewhat fresh servers. Um, I don't know if they wipe or not. It's been up for a while. As you can see, there's a bunch of structures next to me. But they're still very fun. And yeah, I'm super glad to be on them and making a series. Now, I am going to run me a quick little note run. But these servers do have five times rates. So, you know, levels, taming, all that happens very quick. And there's also no tech armor in these servers. And, you know, it's one of the huge reasons why I love them. Because oh, even if you're top of the game, PvP still be extremely fun. Do kind of want to wait on this wide drop, though. Uh, see what it has in for us. Not a bad first drop at all. 98 spark powder. Definitely not complaining. Five times is not blocked off. That's always good. Once you're full. Oh, look, this guy's doing a no-run also. <laughs> That's pretty cool. I do not know the entire direction of this series, um, but I have played on these Conquest servers. They're a ton of fun, and I'm pretty sure I can make a lot of good videos out of them. But I'm pretty much just going to be, you know, trying to conquer the Conquest servers. Um, I am going to build a little base on the island. Oh, I hope I don't die here. I hope I don't die here, because I have a really good run going. I do have a spot in the center, though, that I want to eventually build on uh, that I picked out in the snow. But I think we're going to start here. And hopefully I don't end my note run right here because it's been going smooth so far. No, 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 no. Here, chew on this parasaur. Chew on this parasaur. Chew on that parasaur. There we go. Good boy. But yeah, I'm very hyped up for this and I can't wait to see what this series takes us. Boom, made a level 78 off of the note run. Not bad at all. Do want to try and get some early game metal tools pretty quick. Um, and maybe get a semi-aquatic tame or a cave tame that could run a cave. That'd be nice. Ooh, nice. It's halfway expecting that to just be full of wood. I know what y'all are thinking. Gotta see him take all the pace and not drop the wood. I'm going back. Just don't want to get killed by this stupid beaver. There. There we go. I was literally just about to say an early game Iguanodon might not be bad. I'm going to come across a 145. That would be a crazy tame. I think I'm going to go for some metal tools get a crossbow. Then definitely try to knock this guy out if he's still around here. Because Iguanodons are underrated. Especially early game. Very underrated. Where I just saw Pyromane. Yep, there it goes. <laughs> oh, did you just turn around? Okay. Let's hope that dude does not come up here. Because there is nothing I can do about that right now. Live 262 metal smelting, which is about 131 ingots cooked, if my math is correct. Um, which is more than enough for full flak and metal tools unless the bob runs up and steals it. Let's just hope that don't happen. Go ahead and get some of these going. I saw somebody whistle right next to me. Somebody literally just whistled right next to me. They're on something big, too. I definitely don't like the situation. I don't know if that's them I hear flying around me. I also need water, too. Um, I'm going to try to make a crossbow really quick. Hopefully. Okay, I'm going to just take a look. I need water eventually. I don't see, I know I heard a whistle, then I heard something land. I'm not crazy. I know y'all heard that too. It might have been a bob just whistling in a, uh, one of the little flying things, icky flying thing, whatever it's called. Yeah, because if it wasn't, I thought that they'd probably just storm in there, honestly. That should be okay. 
So I'm gonna go ahead and try to knock out this guy. 17 trank errors should be more than enough. Definitely want to lead him up in the woods though. That's a dude on a moss chop heading straight towards me. Look at that bowler. Oh, I didn't bowler him, I bowler the moss chops. I don't even know what's going on. I'm not even gonna kill him. He, he's definitely a noob. Does have arrows though. <laughs> Good night, youngin. Ooh, 25 tranks. Take that. Take the bolus. Take the stone. I'm gonna leave you to it. Dude is not charging back towards me, is he? Yo, this dude's funny. He's gonna try to kill me. I don't want to kill him, but I will if he tries to hit me. Okay, he seems chill enough. Oh, I just got sick. I knew that was gonna happen. This whole server's sick, so I'm not gonna hate him for it. Well, he seemed pretty chill. Not too mad. I uh, deboed his stuff. I told him I'll give him some metal tools once I get up some. And he said okay, but I'm new on game and don't have any metal. I said don't worry, I don't know if he'll understand DW means don't worry, but I hook him up so I get some stuff. He didn't hit my iguanodon, so I'm not too mad. And to see a moss chops rider, I mean, come on now. That's just instant aura right there, riding on a moss chops. It's funny, bro. Iguanodon's up. Let's do it. I think that's the perfect name for Iguana. I don't know if I spelled her name right, but Iggy Azalea, it'll work. Whoever's base I'm using, Bonsai's, really appreciate it. I got two mortar and pestles, got the campfire, got the smithy, the forge. Two forges would be better, but beggars can't be choosers. You also had a fabby back here, I didn't even see. Definitely uh, probably end up using that before it's all over. Should be the last piece right there. Boom, got the full flak, full flak armor, uh, metal pickaxe, metal hatchet, spike. Got a crossbow. I've only been on like 30 minutes maybe max. Uh, definitely really good to have all this this quick. But something does seem a little yeah. off. <laughs> there we go. That's a lot better. I want to see if I can't find Moss Chops guy. One day I made him a uh, metal pike pickaxe and some pants. Hopefully he's still alive. and pay him back. So the plan is eventually making my main base on the center. But for right now I think I'm going to find me a spot in West Zone. Uh kind of you know west from here because a lot of people go on this little mountain find a little spot maybe make a two by two i'm thinking of a two by two want to be somewhat big because i might stay there for a few days um because my center spot you kind of got to be a little you know have some stuff ready to defend it and also you need a flyer to even get to it so i'm gonna go scout me out a little base area and see if you can't find somewhat you know somewhat hidden spot to put down a little two by two i'm probably gonna start off stone then get it metal pretty fast because we got a lot of metal cooking and it's definitely not hard to get metal with the five times rates on these servers I tried to make it with the idea of it turning into a two by two, you know, putting the structures down and stuff, but it's uh that's that's not gonna happen. I have to destroy and replace stuff. I don't know. I don't know what I was thinking. I was trying to think good, it was just a little too much for me, I guess. I am luckily built in a blue drop zone. There's a blue drop there, blue drop here, so I'm going over there, so we might be able to get some decent loot off drops. I think I just saw a toilet. Oh man, look at that a toilet. That is huge. Uh, we decided to do explants. Already got that. That thing also gives a lot of resources also. So that is always good. For some reason, Iguanodons are incredibly fast swimmers. Like, I'm out swimming the piranhas. Let's see if I can't get some paste and pearls right here. Yes, sir. Nice. There we go. Got a ton of paste. I'm going to hit up a metal run while I'm here. Got my guanon on to about, what was it, around 1,000 weight. So I should be able to, you know, get enough metal to 
get the whole base metal. Um, definitely got the pace. It should be able to carry about 600 raw. A guy on a theory. He's naked on a level 35 Therizinosaur. That is wild. How did he get that? It must have been a baby. It's the only way. What level is he? Okay, he's 73. It's very interesting. Kind of want to kill him. I don't think he has anything, though. I don't know. Now, even though that's only level 35 theory, that is still a theory. Um, I got all this stuff on me, so it is risky. Does he see me? Okay, I'm going to go ahead and drop this, because he'll catch up to me quick with this. Is he going to try to kill me? I don't know if he's going to try to kill me or not. Okay, he's not naked. He has chitin on. Yeah, he's definitely not naked. Okay. I'm going to take off. I'm going to fight now. He can't catch up to me, though. I got unlimited stam. He don't. Yeah, I'm gonna I'm go after him. He's not naked. Go ahead and drop this metal too. On full speed. There we go. Says PT. It's PT here. Bold him. He's naked except his hat. Make this easy. Oh, he whistle neutral. Why is he not dead? I don't know how this dude's not dead, bro. There we go. Okay, I got him. God, I didn't know how he's dead. Okay, so you got this thing on neutral. Both of these are on neutral. Okay. His body's right there. See his bag. Oh, God, that theory about killed me. I'm only level 35. It's crazy. I'm gonna give him maybe to hit this packy and then fight. Try that. Yep, he's on the packy. Nice. I gotta watch this way and make sure he doesn't come back there. Nothing in there. Some narcs. Decent. 15 ingots. His bag is right here. Let's see what he has in his bag. I don't know how this dude got a theory. Okay. Plan X, not bad. Not complaining. 10 tranks, 4 bolas. Pick, a hatchet. Not horrible. I don't know if it was worth me dropping all that metal, but it's definitely fun. 100? I'll definitely take that. Die, bro. I hate bug hitboxes. There we go. Jesus. That's going to be enough kiting for the saddle. Should tame up pretty fast. There we go. No way. A 135. I got to get that. Like, that's like breedable levels. 135. If these Rexes don't snack it up. I know I just tamed this, but I mean, it's right there. I gotta get it. Let's 
I can actually get this thing, that is such a big win. Not gonna lie. 135 PC this early on. It's great. Someone nice. <sighs> Can I get my bird in time, or is it going to die? That's the big question. And not the 135, the one I just tamed. Oh my god, somehow it's still alive. Well, I guess I guess I better hurry up. Oh god. Let me ride. 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 What is going on? Just stuck it staring at my inventory, bro, this game. Woo! I love Ark, man. I love it. There's that PC. For sure. Stop lagging, bro. You just it's doing the same thing. It's just showing me stats about my spear. God. Might as well grab the saddle out of the PC real quick. Hopefully, don't get pounced. Oh my God. Oh, I'm out. Ten second lag every time I open my bag. It's just ridiculous. I can't even scroll over to take off. Okay, come on. No, no, don't fight him. All right. No, oh, serious. There's my Guanadon. Guanadon's dead now. Hundred percent. Guanadon's dead now. Jesus. I need to really try and get to that PC before it wakes up. I know it's probably very close. I don't think they say wait more like fifteen minutes. So I'm gonna head to that first then try to get my bag hopefully i can you know feed them some narcs keep them asleep capro sucus man they're just they're so fun they're so fun i love them they're my favorite creature in the game honestly please still be asleep please still be asleep i hear a raptor i hear two raptors he got killed he got killed oh back to Back to the basics. That was my last hope. It's like, please PT be alive. And it's dead. Yep, right when I got here too. Makes sense. I see him see him munching on its body. And this is what I have to fight for to get to my bag. How great. He hits me once and I'm, I'm broken bones, bro. <laughs> oh my. That's going to be today's video, man. Thank y'all so much for watching. Not the greatest ending, but this is on episode one. I promise y'all the upcoming episodes, tons of PvP and it does get a lot better. So, you know, make sure y'all stay on the lookout for that. If you're new here or a returning viewer, you know, it means a lot to me if you can subscribe, share, and like this video. Once again, man, thank y'all so much for watching and I'll see y'all next time. Peace.